Hello and welcome back. Today we're going to be unboxing the April Shelf Love Crate. So I'm very excited about that. I just got home from work and here's my knife. Okay. Okay, so the theme is saints and sinners. That's what the theme is. This is the spoiler booklet. I'm not going to look at it anymore. I just looked long enough to see uh, what the theme was. Ooh. <gasps> I think it's a wooden bookmark. What is that? Okay, so I'm pretty sure it's wooden. I'm not sure what the fandom is, though, but it's a two-sided bookmark. So I'll look that up in a minute. Next up, there's two of something in here. I wasn't expecting that. Okay, there's one. They look like pillowcases. Okay. Oh my gosh, I am in love. Okay, so I actually happen to know what this fandom is, even though I've not read the book that this fandom is. Sorry. It's Grisha, and this is Fine, Make Me Your Villain. It's a pillowcase. And the only reason that I know what that quote is is because my Instagram post of today was um, based on a Darkling scarf. The prompt was the Darkling scarf, and so I googled Darkling quotes from the Grisha series, and it was fine, make me your villain. So I do actually know what that quote is from. And then this one, you might make me a monster. And it's a matching set and it is gorgeous. I am in love. I've been needing a new pillow set. Cause I have a couple that I've gotten in boxes but they're all like singular. So I have mismatched pillows on my book, on my bed, which is fine. But I love the idea of having a matched set. That's awesome. Okay, this, ooh, this is a book I've been wanting. This is a chapter sample of, I am not going to even attempt to pronounce the author's name, uh, but the book is Kingdom of Exiles from the Beast Charmer series. And this is a little sampler. And I'm so excited because this is a book, it's the most anticipated fantasy romance debut of the year according to this. I'm not sure it's my most anticipated, but it's definitely one I've been anticipating. Okay, is this a sword sticker? Oh, it goes with that. It, I don't know if it's a sticker or I bet it's a tattoo. So it's a sword. I really like it. And then the other side is just Kingdom of Exiles. Okay, okay, so here is this month's, oh. Okay, so I picked something else up in the process. This is this month's chess pieces. And the chess pieces are a um, collectible that they're doing. It's two every month. And I have all of them so far because I'm obsessed with them. And if you like the chess pieces, you don't have to get the full box to get the chess pieces. I think you get the chess pieces if you get just the book option. Not that I'm going to switch my subscription because I'm kind of obsessed with this box. I've been getting this box since January of 2018. And some of them are a little bit hit or miss, but I mean, you get that with every box. But overall, everything has been amazing. So I'm guessing Alina from the Grisha series. I'm gonna go with the Darkling just because he has dark hair that fits, right? Somebody tell me I'm right. I need to take the uh, plastic protective layer off of these. There are protective layers on these, so if you get them, make sure you take the protective layer off. All right, this is Once Upon a Time, an Angel and a Devil Fell in Love. It did not end well. I think it's a sticker, and I love it. I love stickers. I use them in my art journal all the time. Okay. And, oh, I'd forgotten. I was about to say last but not least, we have our book of the month. 
but I had forgotten that, oh, how cool. Okay, so this is the second part of, I'll go get the first part, actually. Okay, I am back, and I'm gonna have to edit that out. There was some undignified screaming going on in the background because I tripped over my cat. And then I ran all the way to my bedroom. And our house is a rectangle, so like, I'm here. I run all the way to my bedroom, which is the far side of the house, because that's where my bookshelf is. And then I remember that the item I'm looking for is actually downstairs with my desk, so then I had to run all the way downstairs. So I'm kind of out of breath right now. I should have just walked, to be honest, and the camera's shaking because my cat is using it as a back scratcher. I trip over you and this is the thanks I get. <sighs> okay, so this was in the January box. Even the smallest person can change the course of the future. And this is in this month's box. And it says courage is found in unlikely places. <laughs> and it's a set, obviously, crap. It's a set, they are bookends. I am obsessed with these bookends. A. B. I was actually not expecting this. When I saw this, I assumed that the match, I knew there was gonna be a matching piece. I thought the matching piece was gonna be The Hobbit because this is The Lord of the Rings and there's a similar silhouette of Bilbo, Gandalf, and the dwarves from The Hobbit. So that's what I was expecting. I wasn't expecting the Eye of Sauron, but I love it. Oh, cool. This is awesome. Okay. So, now we can move to our book of the month. I almost had a mini heart attack. I thought it wasn't recording. And I thought I had done all this and it wasn't recording, but it is recording. Okay, so I actually already have this book. I got it, I think, in my owl crate. But this is an exclusive edition, so I can't complain. This is the bookmark. It has this month's uh, theme art. And what's the, oh my gosh. <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay, this is the regular cover. This is like if you would go to Barnes and Noble and buy this book, this is the cover you would get. But what makes it exclusive, I am in, oh my gosh. Wow, I love it. That lady is beautiful. I'm gonna flip this around and this is what I'm gonna use as the outside of my book. I don't care what I'm supposed to do. Okay, wow. And I, I still have to say, this author, I'm sure she's an amazing person, but that just screams MySpace profile picture. <laughs> It's like edgy emo teen my space profile picture. Not that there's anything wrong with that. That's just what I think. Okay, so that was this box. I think that is everything. It just kept coming. Okay. Whew. So let's see what everything was. Darkling and Alina inspired bed pillowcase set. So that was, oops, I'm sitting on it. I know it sounded like a pig, but that was actually my dog. So the pillowcase set is by Ink and Wonder Designs. Ooh, cool. I like Ink and Wonder Designs. Okay, the vinyl sticker is inspired by Daughter of Smoke and Bone, and it was designed by Bookmarked Tattoos. Um, oh, I thought the woodmark looked familiar. The woodmark is inspired by Nevernight, and it's Mia from Nevernight. Um, and it was by Mono Lime Art. And then of course, the bookend. It was designed by Team Shelf Love. Shelf Love edition of Wicked Saints. Um, okay, I thought the inside, the art on the inside, the style. This was done, this part was done by Navarantail. Um, chapter sample of Kingdom of Exiles, and it will release on June 25th. And then Darkling and Alina again. What is going on with Grisha that I've been getting a ton of Grisha stuff recently? Not that there's anything wrong with that. Just the last Owl Crate and this Shelf Love have both had two Grisha inspired items, which is just a lot. Not that there's anything wrong with that. I just need to read that series. 
I haven't read that series yet. <laughs> Okay, so that is this month's box, and of course, uh, that and the spoiler card. Whew! I'm still sweating from running all the way downstairs. Oh, now the cat and the dog are fighting over who is going to get to knock over my tripod. <laughs> okay, so that was that. I was... Oh! And I forgot about this, it fell on the floor. It's the little, uh, I don't know if it is a sticker or a tattoo. So, I was an influencer for this box, so I got a discount when I bought it, so I have to disclose that. And my influence, What is the word that I'm looking for? My term as an influencer ended. This was my last box. However, this morning when I was at work, I got a message from Shelf Love um, asking me to come on as a rep. So keep an eye out. I will have updates on that. And I think I start in June repping. I'm not sure. I'm very excited. I've been an influencer for a couple of people, which is where you get a discount, but I've never been an actual rep before, so I'm very excited about that. So keep an eye out for that, and I will update the description down below once I know what my code is, so you can use that code to get discounts on your boxes. Thank you for watching, and do not forget to like and subscribe if you want to keep up with me. Instagram is the best place to do that. I am most active on Instagram. Thanks.